and gentlemen. The promulgation of the new constitution on the 28th of August 2010 was the last public appearance by First Lady Lucy Kibaki in what has continued to raise public concern over her whereabouts. But recently, the First Lady has been reaffirming her position, her most recent public address, an Easter message of goodwill to Kenyans. And then the statement, issued by the Presidential Press Service Thursday, a hard stance on politicians who she says are dragging the name of State House into their own political rows. In the statement, the First Lady cautioned those politicians she says use the name of State House to criticize their opponents, especially now with the escalating political temperatures, maintaining the honor of both the institution and the president, whom she says is focused on running the affairs of the state. He ordered me to kneel down, lift my both hands facing Mount Kenya, and say Uhuru Tukopamoja three times. It is a statement that comes just today after Imenti Central MP Gitobu Imanyara issued a personal statement in Parliament claiming that he feared for his life after he was accosted by four men as he drove to his home along State House Crescent Road near State House Nairobi on Tuesday night. In the statement, the First Lady urged leaders to remember their responsibility to continue serving Kenyans during their remaining time in office and focus on that instead of engaging in what she termed as retrogressive politics. She is, however, yet to be seen in person publicly for slightly over one and a half years now. Evelyn Ombwe, Citizen Live at 9.